years, the conservatory industry had very little to offer the homeowner looking for a unique and very personalised space. But market leader Ultraframe has brought to the market the very first glazed extension that can be designed to not only meet your budget, but also your unique personal style. Available in a range of beautiful colours, Loja is taking the conservatory market by storm and homeowners up and down the country for the first time are enjoying living spaces that completely meet their budgets and their personal style. I'm about to meet Peter who is going to talk to me about why they love their lodger and why it's not only added value to their home but why they wish they'd discovered it sooner. Peter, thank you so much for inviting us into your home and we're sat in your beautiful new lodger. That's right, this is what we've, we've finally settled our, our our minds on and we feel it's absolutely right for what we're looking for. So tell me how you came to the decision to have an extension. Well we've been looking at uh, a couple of years uh, since I retired as to extending the, our existing property but it was important we got something that had some empathy with what we've got and we looked at many uh, and I mean many and we looked at the normal what I call stick on conservatory and it just didn't seem to be right and we looked on the internet and eventually I came up against the Ultraframe um, trademark and went into their products and saw the Loggia. It was then that we thought, well, this is this looks like what we could be looking for. Yeah. And that's how we moved it forward. I think because you already have an existing extension as well, so it was important for you to find something that really worked well with that coming into the garden. That's right, that's quite right, because by having that existing extension, we, we had to consider the width, we had to consider the length without t taking too much off our existing garden, and yet, we felt we could gain more by living more or less in the garden, which yes. is what we've got now. So the Loggia is the latest technology in glazed extensions, exclusive to Ultraframe, and it's all about thermal efficiency. They're very cleverly hidden within these beautiful columns at the side, but it's very flexible with design, isn't it? That's right, and, and that's what we looked for when we, when we were looking at it. We're looking for something that offered us um, flexibility in design and flexibility in our use and by having the vertical light and the view into the garden and the heating which is so well hidden the columns it is really just what we were looking for yeah it's good now when we're talking about something that fits in with the with the existing house do you think this is something that that has happened on this occasion oh without doubt there's no question about that yeah we we, we give it a lot of thought it's not something as i say we've looked two years and then once we decided to go down this route and we'd seen the lodger and we'd We'd spoken to the retailer, we decided that this is the way to go and they've been very, very helpful from beginning to end. Now, obviously, Ultraframe has been around for a while and they do know their stuff, but as a consumer, you also, also have very specific ideas. How much input did you have when it came to design? Well, when I say quite a bit, we looked at the ideas that my wife and I had got, because Jane obviously was concerned about uh, having it too big and looking out mm. of place, so that was important to get the blend. And then we listened to what... Um, Ultra Frames retailers offered us and we looked at both concepts and then we felt we struck a happy medium. We stuck out a little bit to get the larger window in here because mm -hmm. we wanted to bring the garden in and then we had the bifolding doors in such a way by, whereby they lined up with opposite glazing so that the whole thing blended quite well. So yeah, we, f we feel it's right, we feel it's, uh, it's added value to our property. So a lot of thought has gone into it. It's a very modern design as well. You've gone with the lower lantern roof. We've got the lovely deep palmets and the spotlights as well. A very modern feel in here. That's right. Well, we, as I say, we looked at it and we looked, it up, we looked at it on the software that the retailer showed to us. And um, it looked to be what we were looking for. And certainly it's developed accordingly. Now, a feature that stands out in this particular extension is the full height glazing. It's very contemporary, it's a very modern feel. It is really, but the full height glazing is important to us and that's why we went for the um, bifolding doors there, which are in line with the um, full height glazing behind me, and that has certainly allowed more and more light to come in, and we're, we're, we're more than happy with it, yeah. It's very bright, isn't it? I think that's a key element in here. It's a beautiful space with great light. Well, that's what we want. We want to get the light in. We, we, we always felt the, that area of the house is a little bit dark anyway. And bringing the light in, it, it certainly, uh, we feel improved. Now, talk to me a bit about the process. How much upheaval was there to your daily lives? Well, very little, really. Um, probably the, the main upheaval was when we had the groundwork here with the, putting the slab in, but all that was done down the side of the property. And um, it, didn't, it didn't inconvenience us at all. And on some days we left them a key to do the job, it was not a problem. 
Um, once the slab was done, we started actually doing the um, erection of the, the structure. Um, that really, I was very surprised, went up in a very short time. And, um, you know, when you think two men with very little effort, or seemed to be to me, <laughs> we, we, we were very impressed. Uh, every, every time we came back from one of our shopping trips, we, it was more and more it developed. It was really good. Now, essentially, it is a, it's a brick-built building, but with a fraction of the cost. Well, that's right. It, it is. But, of course, um, I feel the main factor is the speed of build mm. and the quality of the insulation, quality and the values it's got there. Um, and no mess on site. Probably a week later, um, they sent people back just to what we call do the tidy up program. And uh, when, when they tidied it up and, and sorted it out and, shall we say, polished the glazing, it absolutely looked magnificent. Fantastic. Yeah, really. I think a large consumer worry when picking these glazed extensions is will it be too cold in the winter and will it be too hot in the summer? Will yeah. it retain too much heat? Now, you've been through a summer, yeah. um, so tell us about your experience. Well, they will have the concerns I have, but all I'd say to them is not to worry because you won't have a problem. Um, the lodger specification we are finding, we are now finding, is so good that we need a very minimum amount of heat on. Uh, very rarely, it seems to warm itself up. It's really, really good. They'll have no problems with the thermal quality at all. So how pleased are you with the end <laughs> result? Very, very pleased, really pleased, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's a good decision we've made, yeah, yeah. Well, I have to say, it's, it's, a, stunning, it's yeah. a stunning extension. Thank you so much for letting us take a look. No problem at all, thank you.